What you see behind me are the Charlans, and they stand as an emblem of poverty, displacement, and poor governance. Charlans are river islands or geographical patches of land that emerge because of Padma River constantly changing its path. The islands are within the river channel or is attached land to the river banks. The meandering Padma River that flows along the border of Murshidabad for 60 kilometers also engulfs these river islands. Inhabitants of Charlans, also called Charuas, are left at the mercy of the river and neglected by the government, are perpetually displaced. Char is basically, you can say uh, in English, it is a river island. See the alignment of Ganga, the course of Ganga and Padma, exactly the uh, international border between India and Bangladesh. It is not less than 30 km stretch from the Bangladesh border up to Jalongi. As per the latest figures of 1999, the changing river path displaced about 15,000 families. And recent estimates of the past decade put the number of families displaced at more than 100,000 families due to riverbank erosions and floods. This is the area where you don't have any uh, fencing, nothing is there. BSF is there, Bangladesh Guard is also there, fine, but then vigilance become really very difficult because there is no fencing, there is no hindrances. So it is a truly porous border. So we have reached Faraji Pada and we are trying to go to the Charlands and we have to get permission in order to be able to access the Charlands. Bangladesh border is very close and we have to submit our IDs and that's how we can enter. So we have gotten the permissions and uh, we'll have to take a small ride. Oh, काम करता है खेती है किसी का भेस है। ओ देखो उधर 300 कितना घर है हाँ? सब घर तो नहीं डूबता है। कुछ भी बात सकता है इसलिए जो डूबता है तो उन लोग चलाता है इस स्कूल में हमारा गांव से थोड़ा कम से कम दो किलोमीटर जाने के पहले जाने के बाद एक शाखा आ रहा है ब्रांच आ रहा है पद्मा का वो अभी हमारा गांव का पश्चिम साइड में है वो अच्छे एक डेढ़ किलोमीटर जाने के बाद मिल जाता है तो हम एक्चुअली मेन पद्मा और हमारा ब्रांच के जो मिडिल में जो चर है इस सर में हम लोग बैठते हैं अभी इधर एक्चुअली इस पद्मा के ऊपर हमारा गुस्सा है क्योंकि हमारा घर तो पहले इधर नहीं था वहाँ से जो बी एस बैठा है वहाँ से हमारा पूरा गांव था गांव के दोनों साइड एक रास्ता था बीस बीस में एक रास्ता था दोनों साइड में गाँव था तो एक्चुअली वो गाँव तो दरिया में टूट गया था इसीलिए हमारा पद्मा के ऊपर गुस्सा है जब हमारा और कोई चारा नहीं था कोई जायगा नहीं था तब मेरा को इधर आना पड़ा पुनर्वसन के नाम पे हम लोगों को ऐसे दरिया के अंदर छोड़ के गया है रिवर पद्मा अ डिस्ट्रीब्यूटरी ऑफ गंगा कीप्स चेंजिंग इट्स पाथ क्रिएटिंग फ्लड्स ऑन वन साइड ऑफ द बैंक एंड इरोडिंग लैंड ऑन द अदर शेपिंग एंड रीशेपिंग ऑफ गंगा इज अ कॉमन फिनोमिना दैट इनगल्स पीपल्स लैंड एंड लाइवलीहुड एंड डिस्प्लेसेस देम इट इज फ्लैट अफेक्टेड देन इट इज ह्यूज पॉपुलेशन 40 lakh per year the erosion affected that population might not be less than 20 lakh ye hai flood shelter is flood shelter bhi bhar gaya tha is bar flood shelter hai isliye jab इधर पानी भर जाएगा इधर का लोग उधर रहेंगे लेकिन हमारा घर घर में पानी जाने से पहले ये डूब जाता है एक महीने से 
डेढ़ महीना पहले ये पूरा पानी था हम लोग बहुत कोशिश किया है बार रुकने के लिए लेकिन अभी रुक नहीं पाया है बार पूरा भर गया था Now your everything has gone. Your house has gone. Your land has gone. Your pastel land has gone. Your even uh, domestic animals also might have uh, washed away. So you are left with nothing. Now when this uh, washed away land again re-emerges as chore land or river island, so these people out of compulsion go and settle again there. Now this chore land might not be existing or may, might not be, I mean, continuing for several years. Maybe after ten years, fifteen years, again that will be washed away. So it happens, goes on happening. I can only do what I can. Four years. So our abar hai to five years dharan thakte pare na upare. Abar dharan pube theki bhangwa na istye. Hai to bhenge jato pare. Ama dhe ekhane swami swami kro komir. Potho moto dharan rasta ghat nai. इलेक्ट्रिकर को व्यवस्था छो ना इदानी मैं रानी हो तब कारी कौन थे कौन थे ना चोर मानुष भांगन ग्रस्त लोक एक जनर बाड़ी पाँच सात बार भांगा गे हाँ दुख एम समय कान ना पाए अनेक मानुष कान ना कर घूर आसे बेचपे सारे करते चार धरें खूब जेते आसते ही दिबे ना एम कर मारते जाए फेली दे छुरी फेली दे पानी फेली दे भारत नागरिक कम ना हेल्बा एम अत्याचार हो क्या आसले बोध क्यों क्यों तो चाहे जो ऐले मे के भलो करब शिक्षित करब लिखा पढ़ा करब ऐले पिलर असुविधा खूब पढ़ाशनार दिक दिए हस्पिटल दिक दिए रात बिली तो असुख बसुख हेले परा जाए ना मे जब जब पेहला आया था यहाँ जंगल और जंगल था अभी जो क्लिन देख रहा है ना ऐसा नहीं था या जाने के लिए यहाँ से उधर जाने के लिए ऐसा कोई सुविधा नहीं था जो लोग जाएगा अभी हर टाइम बाइक जा रहा है आ रहा है हम्म उस टाइम नहीं था मैं यह बिजनेस के सिलसिले में आया था जैसा यह जो प्रॉब्लम है ये जो बीमारी का मेरा काम से थोड़ा तो हेल्प होता है गांव का लोगों का यही यहाँ ये दो दो तीन हज़ार या दो हज़ार और तीन हज़ार तीन हज़ार पाँच छः हज़ार लोग हैं दो घर दो गांव में दो दुकान है यही दवाई का ये जो मिलता है दवाई वो देता है और इमरजेंसी जो ट्रीटमेंट है वो भेज देता है यही हमारे पास जो मेडिसिन रहता है वो मैं थोड़ा काम आता है फुल टाइम नहीं फुल टाइम मतलब वो मेरा दवा है वो जो हार्ट अटैक है वो डिलीवरी का और भी पेशेंट है इस इस काम को तो दवाई में मेरे रखता है उसको मैं भेज देता हूँ हॉस्पिटल ये जो ट्रीटमेंट है ये या नज़दीक में मिलेगा तो अच्छा होगा या मेन प्रॉब्लम बीएसएफ या कोई इमरजेंसी दवा है वो लेके जाऊंगा तो आने नहीं देता बोलेगा परमिशन चाहिए डे एक एक आदमी को डेली परमिशन कैसे होगा वो तो उसका काम है दुकान है इनएक्सेबिलिटी ऑफ चार्ल पुशेज दीज डिस्ट्रिक्ट इवन फर्दर अवे फ्रॉम मेन लैंड इंडिया Living in Charlands is filled with challenges, but it is not just the natural causes that add to the floods. So there has been huge human interference and human induced factors, which are working to formation of these Charlands. Faraka Barrage. After independence, India hailed dams as temples of modern India, and so began the construction of Faraka Barrage in 1962 and completed in 1971. The barrage was seen as essential in retaining the navigational status of the Calcutta port since it had never been an ideal port for the movement of big vessels. The plan was to enhance the flow of Bhagirathi Hooghly branch of Ganga. However, there is a huge gap between the real purpose and the actual outcome. In fact, the impact of the barrage is such that it also leads to floods in the neighboring states of Bihar and Uttar Pradesh. The Bihar government has been seeking to decommission the barrage. now when there is <coughs> there is opening of gates flood gates in uh, farakka when you are allowing those sediment to come so where will that sediment go 
the stream flow is not that strong because ultimately total water availability in the uh, river is not that high because you are in a tapped water so this entire sediment is now being settled in the downstream of Paratka and that is causing formation of Chorland and meandering of river. Around 50 lakh people are affected along the river. But neither the government of India nor West Bengal has a policy for victims of river erosions. There was only a handful of people who were given some sort of rehabilitation. But don't, government doesn't have any comprehensive policy to rehabilitate these people. I am having a written history of six generations. Okay, And in six generations, we had been always uh, the resident of, uh, I mean, the very close vicinity of Ganga. So during six generations, we have, uh, we have changed our residence four times. Not only resident, it is a village, entire different uh, settlement that has happened. Abul is just one of the many displaced. People have moved between 4 to 16 times in the last 15 years. Poverty is a major reason that has deadlocked people between a meandering river and two international borders. You give compensation to these people who suffer from the flood. If the crop is lost, give compensation to them. Allow them to cultivate their land give support to them instead of constructing flood protection embankment let the flood water be spread in its natural area known as flood plain so flood plain also will be benefited the people living in the chorland land they are also be benefited but it is height of expectation that the chor people will can be removed altogether from the chor land no they will not they will not go because there is no way there is no place to go for them even if you are giving, let's say, two katha of land, maybe 1,500 square feet of land to construct house, where from, where from they will get money? But then where is the livelihood? Land is located somewhere else. You are rehabilitating these people somewhere else. So how they will cultivate their land? There are apprehensions that in near future, Ganga River will even outflank Harakka Barish. Karakka barrage will be redundant. And there are enough evidences. If you go upstream of Karakka, then we'll find that that process is going on. So you are playing with river. You are, I, I can use a very harsh term. You are plundering with river. So river will take revenge on you. 